for the 2014 Minnesota Business Ethics Award in the large company category, the MBEA recognizes Restaurant Technologies and Marvin Windows and Doors. Will representatives come forward? I'm going to start with Restaurant Technologies, or RTI. It's based in Mendota Heights and works with over 20,000 food service locations on efficiency, safety, cleanliness, and sustainability in the delivery, delivery storage, handling, and disposal of fryer oil. You learn a lot about businesses when you're in this, this, this role. I, I didn't think of that, but somebody has to deal with that, and they do it extremely well, is what I've gathered. Here are some highlights that caught the judge's attention. Um, the company has a, really a standout reputation in its industry and a high commitment to ethics. They have something they call their core values, which they refer to as their five C's, customer, character, commitment, courage, and community. And they roll those values into all aspects of their business operations. They include those in employee assessments as well, so when they're doing performance evaluations. And they have a very strong commitment to transparency in pricing when dealing with contracts and vendors. Despite being very decentralized, the employees are dispersed across 41 sites, as I understand it, restaurant technology has been able to build a cohesive culture that is guided by those core values. It's also noteworthy that in an organization, or rather an industry, where employee turnover is as high as 80%, their turnover is very low they have an employee retention rate of 80%. And they're in the top 2% of co companies in the industry for employee engagement. And their actions are driven by values. They've elected to discontinue working with a major client due to concerns about trust, and in another case stopped working with a customer due to the way RTI employees were treated by the customer. We at the MBA are very proud to honor Restaurant Technologies with the 2014 MBEA Award. Well, um, thank you very much. It's an honor to represent the 750 RTI employees by accepting this award. And thank you for everybody with the MBEA uh, for all the work that you put into it. Uh, nominees, you know how much work went into it, but we learned quite a bit about our company what parts were aspirational as we went through the uh, nominee process. So we learned quite a bit, so we thank you for that. You know, one of the things that we have found by having such clear values is that we were able to build an organization and a culture with high trust. And so if you're thinking about how do you, how do you connect ethics with business strategy, I'd recommend, and I, 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 we live by this, that if you in a very transparent organization with high trust, speed becomes a strategic advantage. There's no meeting be before the meeting, there's no meeting after the meeting. Decisions are made with, within clear parameters and change happens quickly. So uh, as you're thinking through your organizations, please uh, think through those thoughts as well as some of the other great ideas that have come from Mary as well as the other recipients. Thank you for your time and again, thank you MBA. Next, permit me to share one or two highlights about Marvin Windows and Doors. Uh, as, as many of you no doubt are aware, Marvin Windows and Doors is one of Minnesota's outstanding companies. Uh, to say that it has a long and impressive track record is, is uh, understating the facts. It reaches back to 1912 and has a truly remarkable and sustained commitment to the communities that it serves and to its employees and to working with its third-party vendors and installers. The Marvin entry demonstrated very strong level of leadership commitment in all aspects of their operations. And that commitment shows up in their business practices and when they deal with difficult dilemmas and challenges. As one of our judges said, 
Their values are baked into their business model. Examples in their entry were numerous, reaching back to rebuilding after a terrible fire in 1961 when there were clearly other options available to them. They wanted to stay in the community and support their employees in the community. Extensive support on a regular basis for employee involvement in many, many community initiatives, standing behind their products and supporting their channel partners and earning the loyalty of those same partners. As Marvin puts it, quote, ethics is the cost of an organization is the cost, let me start that again. Ethics is the cost an organization is willing to incur to uphold its values. In the judge's view, in one word, two words, Marvin walks its talk. It is our pleasure to recognize Marvin Windows and Doors with the 2014 Minnesota Business Ethics Award. Good afternoon. So on behalf of our family and the company, thank you very much for this award. We are extremely honored and grateful. And this recognition is to be shared with each and every person in our organization. The employees at Marvin Windows and Doors work hard to uphold the highest ethical standards and to live out our values and purpose of our business each and every day. So Marvin is a third and fourth generation family owned business and I am extremely honored to be one of the 11 fourth generation family members working here today. I have uh, two cousins and a sister in the back, Dan, Ginny, and Victoria, who are here today. They just raised their hand a little bit so you can see who they are. So like my cousins and my siblings, some of whom again are here today, I've been around the business since childhood and have had the great privilege and honor of learning from the generations of leaders before us and how to uphold Marvin as an ethical company. It has been instilled in us from a very early age the importance of being engaged, giving back, and taking care of our customers, our employees, and our communities. Just like the third generation, we were taught that along with the privilege of operating a business comes a responsibility to others. My great-grandfather, George Griffin Marvin, and my grandfather, William S. Marvin, and all of the third generation that is in leadership at Marvin have operated under one simple directive, and that is doing the right thing. During one of the worst recessions that our industry has ever seen, we chose to stay true to our values and vowed not to lay off a single employee or cut back their health care benefits. Doing the right thing meant that, in that instance, that we are standing behind one of our greatest assets, and that's our employees and our community. If we would have laid off our employees, they're our friends, our family, our neighbors, they would have been impacted, and our small community of World Minnesota would have been impacted. Each and every time, by staying true to our values and doing the right thing, it has paid off and it has made us stronger. So I want to tell a quick story from when my grandfather was running the company. We share profits with our employees when the times are good, and we do it annually at the end of the year. One year was pretty tough, and there were few profits to be shared. In fact, I don't think there are any to be shared. But as my grandfather took the stage at that annual meeting, an employee named Rex Clay stepped forward, and he took the mic, and he said, you have always stood by us and shared in good times and we will stand by you when the times are tough. And as he spoke, dozens of employees walked up the aisle with hundreds of yellow roses, and they gave them to my grandfather and to my grandmother. So this gesture said more than we ever could about our, our relationship with our community and our company that has supported us and that we have supported for more than 100 years. So hopefully, the decision to recognize our family's business bears witness to the fact that we have been good stewards of a purpose that we feel is worthy. We are lucky to be one of many great companies here today and extremely honored to be standing here accepting this award. So again, on behalf of the employees of Marvin Windows and Doors, thank you for this wonderful recognition. Thank you. Thank you. 